Hello everyone and welcome to Archie Diaries. You must be wondering why I've gathered you all here today. It's because I did my makeup for once. Um, it's more costumey because it was kind of a themed birthday party that I went to, but um, also my lashes off. Ignore it, it's fine. I've had this makeup on for a very long time. Don't judge, okay? I feel like I really misrepresent myself on YouTube. Like I'm a lot more put together than I let on think okay so i thought i would do a little haul should i turn the light on let's see anyways hello there's a fly anyways oh my god i'm here to do a quick little haul and kind of update you on what's been going on if you care um, so first, I'm gonna do the haul because I'm sure not that many people care about what's going on. It is called Arcade Diaries, so it's just a diary for me. Only I have to care, and I barely do. So I can't blame you if you don't. Anyways, I went on a little, um, shopping spree. I'm promising myself that I am not shopping for a while. I need to stop. It's too much, okay? Um, but anyways, today's outfit i don't know if i've shown before or no but this is a set from splash it's this brown top and matching skirt which you can't see but it's just the skirt i mean there's nothing to see um so that's what i'm wearing i did buy this necklace from la visa so you can actually hook it like this and make it into kind of like a kind of like a polo tie moment a super long polo tie moment and then the second thing that I got from Lavisa is this super cool like bracelet ring thing and it keeps getting messed up but it's still cute and these rings are from Lavisa too but they're not new um this one is too but it's not new and yeah that's it for that and then I did get one more thing from Lavisa they always have kind of like buy two get one or buy one get one half off or whatever um so this one was buy two get one free so I got this this and this necklace which also kind of changes length how you want it to so i thought that was cool um clearly i'm trying to be more colorful in my wardrobe i got this from stradivarius and i got matching pants with it um but the pants are at the tailors right now because i'm really short i could have used the bigger size to be honest but i already kind of wore it so it's a little bit too late now um the other thing that i got from stradivarius are these pink heels that are so cute i used to be a super pink person in the days of sharpe evans and uh, paris hilton being everywhere but these are super cute and i am trying to wear more color and they're like an appropriate height to like be comfortable you know um so yeah these i got and then i did get one more thing that i think is so out of the box for me but I kind of don't want to show it because I want to do a photo shoot with it. So um, follow me on Instagram so you can see when I put that up. You'll know. You'll know what I'm talking about. But it's a set. I'll just say that with an animal print. Okay, and it's not cheetah. So it's not what I'm used to. Anyway, then um, I went to Splash and I got a couple of really cute things. So first off are these two shirts. Um, this one's white and this one's black. I did get two of them. Reason being... I love button-down shirts. I have so many button-down shirts. I've been inspired by, honestly, mainly Lisa Vanderpump. I feel like wearing um, a shirt like this, a button-down shirt and jeans and some heels is like such a boss move. Um, so yeah, that's kind of why I love button-down shirts, but I got it in black and white. I will size up in this one, I think, though, uh, because this fits perfect on me. And the one thing that holds me back from wearing button-down shirts is the fit so yeah i got these two because i love glitter and i love shirts so i had to um and then i got this vest it's really cool i don't know if you can tell but the tailoring on it is really nice and um you could kind of tighten the back to fix how it looks on you um so yeah that's another thing that i got i do love me a vest i got this in black and in brown and i love it so i found a white one it's really good it tucks into your pants perfect for hijab because with shirts like this you can have to wear something that's like high so you don't have to keep adjusting when your neck shows and stuff so i love shirts like this and i like that it's 
um, short sleeve because all the ones that I have are t-shirts and that can get super annoying in the summer. This is the last thing that I got from Splash. It's just a nice little casual um, shirt and it's super light. I just, this is good to throw on when I go to like anywhere. I was gonna say shopping, but no more shopping for me. Okay, I don't know if I showed these or not, but I got these shoes from Bershka and honestly, they're very uncomfortable and they get dirty really fast, but I hate white shoes. I think they look like nurse shoes no matter what. These are the only white shoes that I've ever seen that don't look like nurse shoes and it doesn't look like it on camera or maybe it does, but they're super high and they kind of go like this, which I hate and shoes like that I can only wear if I'm sitting down, but they're cute. So random things that I got. I got this Nivea cream. I don't like Nivea. It's not my thing. Um, not my brand. I don't like it. But um, this was interesting because it's a hand lotion with, well, it's a body face hand lotion that I would only use on my hands. That is um, SPF 15. And when I drive, I feel like my hands are really exposed to the sun. And I know it's weird, but always wear SPF. I put on so much SPF on my face. I never walk without an umbrella in the sun. Um, so yeah, I thought this would be a good investment for me because Botox and filler is much more expensive than hand cream. The last thing that I'm going to show you is this, which I thought was really cool. If you're a hijabi and you don't like those like burkinis, like they're not my style. Like right now I'm wearing the skirt and I hate how I look in it to be honest. I'm not like a skirt person. Um, so this is kind of a good alternative to the burkini. I hate that word, first of all, ew, but it's a really good alternative if you don't like the, like how burkinis usually look. I got this from Max, I believe, Max, I think, wait, yeah, so I got this from Max and it is a little, like, le I don't know what you call this, like a leotard, kind of, um, it's super high neck, which is great. Um, and then it comes with leggings, but I'm not gonna wear its own leggings because they suck I'm gonna wear my own leggings, but basically you can wear any black leggings with this and then here's the great kind of like innovation here It comes with a which I'm holding upside down. It comes with a skirt. You wrap it around yourself so that Your kind of like your legs aren't exposed if that makes sense Not your legs, but like your the upper part of your legs. I don't know how else to explain it um, but basically like your behind and your legs will be covered with a skirt and it's so cute because I really hate how burkinis look. It covers the same amount that a burkini would cover for a word that I hate. I sure do say it a lot, but it covers the same amount. It just does it in like a cuter way. Um, so yeah, it's a skirt that you wear over the leggings and this and then if you are alone with girls you could wear this with a skirt i don't like to show my legs that much but um yeah uh thank you guys so much for watching uh subscribe if you want to if you don't that's fine and yeah comment down below what you want to see if you want to if you don't want to comment that's fine i get it i never comment on videos that's karma okay bye